Look at this baby girl and her bumbo. Hi, you're doing pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's pretty cool, huh? Yeah, and, and there's You can hang out in there. Um, yeah, I took the tray off. I took the tray off, yeah. Look at those little feetsies. Yeah. You like that, Vera? She's like, I don't want to sit in it. Pretty girl, you ready for this? The doctor's going to come in and see you. Yeah. Goodness, you move a lot. Yeah. All right, mommy, ready? Mommy, how's Arya? She's great. Good. She's Aya. great. Baby, yeah. hey, you got a bounce. You gave me a bounce. Now, okay, mommy. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, mommy. 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 Come on, mommy.
Alrighty, you guys, it is time. And that time is to have Aria sleep in her crib in this room. Um, I didn't want to do it just yet, but she's getting really big for her cradle. She's getting to the point where she moves around a lot. She's just fixing a hinge. But she's getting to the point where she moves around a lot and she hits the sides of the cradle and she makes it wiggle so much at night and she hits her head on the sides. And you're probably thinking, just put a bumper on it, but no, it's just too big. I mean, she's too big for it now. So that means she has to go in the crib. Are you ready for that? And she's been taking naps in the crib, so... Um, anyway, I'm a little scared just because... Not scared, but I'm not looking forward to walking all the way over here when she needs to eat at night. But it'll be good. We'll have both girls in here, so it's kind of different because every time that we've moved our babies from the cradle to their crib in their room, it's only been their room. There's no other kids in there, so this time she's moving in with her sister. Okay, try that. So, this door makes noise when you slowly close it and I just need that to go away. Good. Okay, do it a couple times quick or I can. Quick? Yeah. Feels good. Another thing we have to do is we have to figure out where we're gonna put the cam- I hope you guys can hear me over that. Where we can put the camera to possibly view Aria and Vera. It, oh, I mean, that's what you want? Yeah, I want, I want us to set the camera where we Daddy, can see both. can I see? But I need it to be close enough Daddy, to Aria so that I, I can try? just see if she's breathing. Because that's the biggest thing. I mean, at nighttime, I'm constantly getting up just to see if she's still breathing. I shouldn't worry too much because she sleeps on her back. She's never on her side or on her belly. But it's just the worries of a mommy. Is that loud? That's pretty loud, huh? Oh, don't sure gag you. yourself. So it's exciting, but it's sad. It's very exciting for us to have our room back where we can hang out in there and talk and so and get that cradle out of out of there because it's it is pretty big. It takes up a lot of room. So we'll be able to put it away and watch we'll have to take it back. Night. Yeah, we can watch movies at night. We'll be able to anything else. Huh? No, I think that's good. Do it slowly, that's when it does it. No, you gotta do this to get I, I know, it. but I'm just telling you to do it slowly to see if it's really gonna not be loud anymore. Okay. The test. Slowly. Nice. Okay, she's in her crib, but she's still awake. What? You can see her scary eye right there. Scary. <laughs> can you see Vera? I don't think so. Uh, just barely. I can mm -hmm. see her moving. The camera has a little red light on it, and I think that's why she's like staring at it. You see that? Right there. But at least she's not crying. I hope she falls asleep on her own. But, oh, so cute. Her little hand. We'll see how it goes tonight. Wish us luck. Even though you'll see this after. So we made it. We made it through the whole night being away from Aria. Or I did. It's a big deal to me. She woke up twice, and my whole dilemma was if I was going to feed her there when she woke up, or feed her, or take her to my room and feed her there like I always do. And so I decided to take one of my pillows and put it against the wall on Vera's bed so I can sit there and feed her. And so that worked out. She woke up twice last night, and she did so good. She went to bed at 8, woke up twice woke up at seven so she did so good and and I was okay too like at first when we were just barely going to bed I just kept looking at the monitor is she okay is she okay but she's fine 
um, Vera, she took a longer time to fall asleep, but anyway, the fact that we laid Aria down while she was awake and she still fell asleep on her own, that's great. And the way it, Vera, Vera, what, what's that screaming for? And the way it has worked out whenever Aria does get up at night, what I mean by that is she'll wake up, I feed her real quick, and she eats really fast in like three minutes. So she eats in three minutes, and then I put her up on my shoulder, and I try and burp her like one minute, not even, and she'll burp, and then I lay her back down while she's still awake. I tuck her back in again, I give her a binky, and she's she'll fall asleep on her own. That's what I mean by she wakes up at night. That's what she goes through. She doesn't stay up for an hour, no. It's just to eat burp and put her back in bed. Um, no, I don't change her diaper at night. But anyway, she does so good and it worked out so, it worked out perfect. I hope every night is like tonight. Watch. I need better knock on wood because I know I, every time I say something to you guys, like the next day it's the total opposite. So I need to remember to knock on wood whenever I tell you guys something. Okay. She's awake. She just woke up from her morning nap. I'm going to show you how we do this. <gasps> Hi. Good morning. Good morning. I'm so happy. Huh? <laughs> Here. Let's, let's let you stretch. Okay. Let's stretch. Oh, I love it. I love it. Did you sleep okay? That's where her camera is. I know, weird spot, but we try to make put it there so that we can kind of view Arya and then view Vera, but it doesn't work very good, so we'll just have to use it for Arya. Yes, yes, pretty girl. <laughs> One minute, girl, okay? Soon it will be two. This, you guys, this happens like four times a day. No joke, four times a day. Yesterday, well, yesterday was three. The day before, it was four. This is the second time today. So, and it's barely 10.35. There you go. Toys, milk. And it, it wasn't like, like she spilled a little bit, and she was like, oh, I already spilled some, and she like poured the rest. These kids are being so good. They're putting all the Legos away. Good job. They want to play with another toy. And I said, you have to pick up these Legos. Good job, Vera. It's usually just Derek making a mess. And so I told Derek, you need to clean it up. And Vera always helps. She's such a good sister. Okay. Yes, you are.